Well, Kate Ritchie grew up on our screen. She clocked up 20 years and more than 4,000 episodes on Australia's favourite soap, Home and Away. We may be running some old vision. Are you OK with that? Well, that's to be expected. Yeah, all right, as long as you're OK with it. Uh, but proving there is a life away from the bay, she's gone from radio success to a doting mum. Cute clip. Kate Ritchie is the original Summer Bay sweetheart. For over 20 years, we watched on as she grew up as one of the show's most loved characters, Sally Fletcher. Oh, sorry, how could I forget him? Her emotional departure from Home and Away in 2008 pulled at the nation's heartstrings. Really hard to say goodbye to someone that everything I've ever achieved has been with her in my life. As did her brief return to the show in 2013. This is it, Pip. We're home. Kate Ritchie. In the years since Home and Away, Kate has gone from strength to strength. Rather than heading to Hollywood like so many of her co-stars, she excelled here in radio. She's enjoyed as many successes in her personal life, becoming a mum late last year to little May. OK, Kate Ritchie joins us a lot. Bless. Oh, you need a... Oh, oh look at her. For the Logie's dress or that beautiful <laughs> baby. I know you did a bit of a running commentary on my wardrobe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Good. Oh yeah, no, no. Oh good. Kylie's good for a bit of side commentary. Because <laughs> black is like the, is the new the, black. The, the we black. have colour coordinated yeah, and matching I, bracelets. I have to say, oh. I was a little bit nervous about wearing shorts on the show this morning because I knew I was going to be sitting next to possibly well, the I hottest know, legs I, in TV. I know, but I wore jeans today, <laughs> so it's fine, right? Um, to, that old stuff. Like, yes. We love it so much. Yes. Because you grew up before our eyes. What, yeah. What do you think of it? Do you? Oh, you happy I still every now love it. I mean, how to to not love it would be to deny twenty years of yeah. my life. It's like flicking back through old photographs. We all enjoy we all enjoy doing that. But of course, it is nice to be reflecting on on the new stuff as well. Yeah, yeah sure. Because then we'll we do that in But that's years. not as embarrassing, <laughs> though. But, um, but because yeah. we do tend to think of you like this, and then we, next moment we see you sort of nursing a baby, and it's like. <gasps> Kate has grown up, hasn't she? I oh know. my, she's a she's a mum now. Well, I think I, I make people feel incredibly old sometimes because I have people stop me in the supermarket and they'll say, "Oh, what are you doing now?" Mm. And I say, oh, "I'm working with Nova." Oh, how old are you? Mm. And I've I've just recently turned 37, and and I can see them doing the math in their head, thinking, "If Sally Fletcher is 37, how old does <laughs> that make me?" <laughs> That's right. <laughs> how beautiful is May? What, what oh, a gorgeous little well, creature. Well, I, I am, in, well, I'm biased, but I think she is divine. I mean, she's the, she's the greatest achievement I have ever had. Um, and she's, yeah, she's wonderful. She's oh. 14 months oh, now. Nice and so she's just up on her feet and she's, she's a complete joy. Is she like mummy or daddy? Is she a bit of a show off? Oh. I don't, I don't know who too, she's like. She, she's in, she's very happy. Um, so I don't know. Is that I don't know if that's me. Her father will probably say it's like her. Um, <laughs> but um, yeah, she's she's developing her own little personality. And and I, now I don't want to be one of those parents who just talk about her and how great she is. But yeah, she's no, we pretty, are, we are, she's we are. pretty special. Right, well, let's <laughs> talk about you and how great you are. Oh, okay, okay. Um, but how how that's likely to reflect on her? Yeah, well. Um, what, because you spent your life on the telly, mm. is that so, if she gets to an age where she says, Mum, I'd like to do that, mm. is it a life that you would recommend and endorse for your daughter? Um, you know what, it was only the other day that Marty Sheargold, who I do the Nova show with, he said something similar on air about how my life may uh, affect May's life growing up and the decisions she may make. Um, the thing is, my experience growing up in the spotlight or growing up on television, I think, is very unique because growing up on a show like Home and Away was a family, and it sounds kind of, you know, soppy, but it, it's That's so true. supportive. Yeah, yeah. There was nothing scandalous about it. We all loved each other, but I don't necessarily think that is the norm. Mm. So I'd be kind of torn, I think. You know, yeah. I, I would love her to have the experience I had, but I'm not sure that you're ever guaranteed that. Mm. So, so, so you say growing up like a family, which members of the family do you still see? 
Well, who, who are the black sheep cousins? Oh, the now, cousins that never, you, yeah. now that you've moved out of yeah. one, you're glad you don't have to see yeah. them anymore. I, will, I have to say um, Ray Maher, of course, mm -hmm. uh, and I do still stay in contact mm -hmm. with Ray. Mm -hmm. And Emily Simons, uh, who has yes. had her own little baby recently. Yes, um, she's had a little baby. Boy, didn't she? she yes, she did. Yes. Henry yes. Um, and Alex Paps and Deborah Lawrence and a lot of the a lot of the oldies. So. Uh, what, what's key to leaving the bay? And some people have done it successfully, and some you know we don't hear much from again. But some yeah. of them get, go straight from Summer Bay over to Hollywood and yeah. do great stuff. You've gone into the wireless, uh, you know, the wireless business on the radio. Yes. And having great fun, winning awards all over the place, yes. and really enjoying it. Right. Yeah. It's a, it's a great transformation. Oh, it, it, I've been um, very lucky, I suppose. I think I've worked really hard, but I, I have been lucky that when I first left Home and Away, I worked with Nova, and now I'm back there doing the drive show in the afternoons with Tim and Marty, and it's wonderful. It's, it suits my life perfectly, of course. Um, I'm, you know, I don't have to get up at the crack of dawn like you guys, um, and I'm finding my own voice and having a bit of fun, and don't get me wrong, I would love to be back on the television again one day yeah. soon, and, and that will hopefully be on the cards. And there are a couple of naughty boys too. I listen, there are a couple of naughty boys. Oh, so they're out of control. Is, is I mother, think that's why I'm your there. Mothering, your mothering yes. skills? Yes, yes. <laughs> um, so there's still the Sally Fletcher at work there, yeah. really. It's, kind of, it's me kind of controlling the household and putting people in their naughty corners. Right, right. Um, but the, the boys are great and we are having some great success and people love the show. It's a bit of a... It is a bit in at times, but I think that's why people... People love it. And just sure. quickly, do you think that you have moved on, therefore? Do you think people now see you as Kate Ritchie the person or do you think there is still because how long have you been on the radio for now uh, this is the end of my second year right. with the drive show with yeah. that drive show but um, you've been on radio previous to that yes. as well so do you think you've moved shed yeah oh, well not if you keep showing clips <laughs> like that I mean I think I do and yeah. then I come and do this and then no, we drag yeah. you no. back do you know what I don't I would never want to say goodbye to that completely because mm. it's a big part of who I am yeah. but it's wonderful to have yeah to have moved uh, always yeah, lovely to good. see you continued success on the radio plenty more awards to come for you oh, and you. Uh, we can guarantee you one thing that next time you come back we will use that vision oh again. great oh yeah. great it's, I can't wait it's priceless <laughs> good to see you